time for my song and dance. Bye-bye, <laughs> Blackboard. Oh, 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 Blackboard, uh, I have hurried all the way from the other end of the ship. Huh. Oh, and just in time, look. Come on, Rocket, open up. <gasps> Mr. Squiggle, are you asleep? Uh, slightly, Rebecca, slightly. But, Mr. Squiggle, you can't be at Squiggle time. Rebecca, did you actually say Squiggle time? Uh-huh. Then what are we waiting for? Nothing. Uh, hurry uh. up. Oh, Blackboard. OK, Mr. Squiggle, open those eyes. Come on, wake up, wake up. Yes! <laughs> Rebecca, you are quite an eye-opener. Oh, Mr. Squiggle, you say nice things to me. Ah, as always, Rebecca. Now, Mr. Squiggle? Yes? Would you like to know who this Squiggle comes from? Oh, indeed, from? indeed. OK, it comes from Talitha and Denise Cook, who live in Heathridge in Western Australia. Really? Yes. It's a tricky one. Is it? Mm hmm But not too tricky for you. Well, I wouldn't say that, Rebecca. Oh, but I can. You can? I can. Uh -huh. With facility, I would Absolutely. say. Absolutely. Yes. Now. Uh, there, how's that, Rebecca? Well, that's what can I, I thought. tell you honestly, Mr. Squiggle? Honestly? I don't know what it is. Do you? Really? You do? I'm surprised, Rebecca. Well, I think everybody else knows what it is, but I don't yet. That's understandable. <laughs> Are you going to give us a clue? Ah, uh, well, it's almost there, Rebecca. And it's upside down. Everything is these days. And it's somebody holding an umbrella. It's a frill necked lizard but where's the frill the frill has slipped and is now round her waist oh what a beautiful frilly <laughs> skirt <laughs> <laughs> that's great mr Squiggle. a frill neck lizard i yes. like them okay yeah. are you ready for this one uh, oh, uh yes rebecca and you're still awake hurry up uh, well, that was blackboard it was okay uh, rebecca you're holding my hand of course i am <laughs> of course i am mr Squiggle. yes rebecca firm and fast ah what should i make of it well that's what I thought. If I knew, uh, I'd tell you, but I don't. I'm but sure you know, Rebecca, but you're keeping it a secret. Well, I'll tell you who sent it in, oh, shall good. I? It comes from Chris, Kim and Glenn Jackson, who uh, live in Wilton in New South Wales. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Another tricky one? Well, when three, three heads get together, uh -huh. it's bound to be tricky. That's it. Oh, Mr Swiggle. Yes? Are they two eyes I can see? Uh... Probably, Rebecca. Does anyone know what it is? Uh, of course they do. Everyone oh. does, except Rebecca. Oh, Mr. Squiggle. Is that a big cloud? Uh, well, it could be. That looks like an H down there. Uh, that's H for honey. Ah, oh, so is that a honey pot? Yes, this is a bear who can't quite remember where he left his honey jar. I hope he finds it. Well, I, well... It's gone to his head. If he looks in the mirror, he'll see that it's on his head. <laughs> he looks very surprised about that, doesn't he? <laughs> That's great, Mr oh, Squiggle. Oh, oh, it's time to go, Rebecca. Oh, Mr Squiggle, I'm sorry that oh. you have to go so oh. soon. But you know what? What's that? I think that you should get mm. Rocket to take the slow way home mm. so that you can sleep for longer. Oh, and then I'll land on the moon wide awake and ready for anything. Yes. Rebecca, you really, really are such a help. Oh, Mr. Squiggle, I try to be. Of course. <laughs> goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye Rebecca. Bye, Mr. Goodbye. Squiggle. Safe trip. Oh, there you go. Bye, Bye Rocket. Have a good trip, Rocket. <laughs> Bye. Bye.